Good morning. So my dis or my last discussion for the second sem sa therapeutic modalities is module 10 reformation program. So ito na yung last discussion ko for uh, therapeutic modalities hanggang module 10 lang. So first reformation program. Therapeutic community. The therapeutic community or yung tinatawag nating TC program represent a highly and effectively highly structured environment with defined boundaries, both moral and ethical. So, so yung therapeutic community program natin, okay, nababound siya in two, yung moral and ethical. The primary goal is to foster personal growth. This is accomplished by reshaping an individual's behavior and attitude towards with the inmates community working together to help themselves and each other restoring self-confidence and preparing them for the reintegration into their families and friends as productive members of the community. So once na nilagay ka dito sa uh, therapeutic community, kailangan ka nilang baguhin, i-reshape as a better person. Kasi once na lumabas ka na, okay, ah, uh, Bagong uh, new person ka na ulit. Hindi ka na yung dati. Patterned after data, therapeutic community, New York, which is the base of the therapeutic community movement in the world. The Bucoy therapeutic program was adopted as part of the Bureau's uh, holistic approach to inmate rehabilitation. It is implemented primarily but not limited to drug dependent. So, nakabase pala yung uh, therapeutic community sa New York. Doon talaga yung pinaka uh, main nila. So, yun ang tinatawag natin therapeutic community. The therapeutic approach or the therapeutic community approach has been continuously proven worldwide as an effective treatment and rehabilitation modality among drug dependent. So, nakakatulong din to sa mga drug dependent and have been noted to be effective in many prisons. By immersing a drug offender in the TC environment, he learned why he developed his destructive habits which lead him to substance abuse. So, once na nilagay, nil, nilagay na sila sa therapeutic community environment, doon na nila natututunan Okay, kung bakit nila na-develop yung habit nila na yun. And paano nila babaguhin yung sarili nila. The program's negative behavior and or attitude while restoring uh, self-confidence and prepare inmate for their reintegration into their families and friends and productive members of the community. This behavior modification program gradually reshapes and re re in re structured the inmates with a family-like environment wherein every member act as his brother's keeper. As therapeutic community family, members go, go on with their daily activities a strong sense of responsibility and concern of each other's where, uh, welfare is developed. They are constantly being monitored with their progress and are regularly evaluated by the therapeutic community trained staff. Okay? The TC process allows for genuine intro its uh, inspection, cultivation of self-worth and positive rationalization that move the individual towards assuming the greater sense of personal and moral responsibility. The effort of the Bureau of Correction to rehabilitate the drug dependent under its care using the TC approach is in line with its commitment to create a drug-free prison. Worldwide developments in the treatment and rehabilitation of drugs offenders using their therapeutic community approach have been noted to be effective in many positions. So, what is therapeutic community? Ano nga ba yung tinatawag nating therapeutic community? The therapeutic community is an environment that helps people get help while helping others. 
it is a treatment environment. So, therapeutic community, doon ka nila kailangang ilagay para matulungan ka nilang magbago. The, interac uh, the interaction of its members are designed to be therapeutic within the context of the norms that require for each to play the dual role of client therapist. At a given moment, one may be in a client role when receiving help or support from others because of a problems or behavior or when experiencing distress. At another time, same person assume a therapist role when assisting or supporting another person in trouble. So, yan yung tinatawag nating therapeutic community. How does therapeutic community looks like? The operation of the community itself is the task of the residents working under staff provisions, work assignment called job functions, are arranged in hierarchy according to seniority, uh, seniority individual progress productivity. So, para siyang chain of command, my hierarchy. This include conducting all house services such as cooking, cleaning, kitchen services, minor repair, serving as apprentices and running all departments, conducting meetings and per encounter groups. The therapeutic community is operates in a similar fashion to a functional family with a hierarchical structure of older and younger members. Each member has a defining role and responsibilities for sustaining the proper functioning of the therapeutic community. These are sets of rules and community norms that members upon entry commit to life by an uphold. So, yan, meron, meron silang uh, sinusunod kasi sabi ko nga para siyang chain of command. Uh, meron rin silang mga hierarchy according to seniority, uh, seniority pababa. So, yun ang therapeutic community. What are the silent features of therapeutic community? So, una, the primary therapist and teacher is the community itself, consisting of peers and staff who are role models of successful personal change, serve as guides in the recovery process. So, yan yung mga tumutulong sa kanila. Therapeutic community adheres to precepts of right living, truth, honesty, here and now personal responsibility for destiny, social responsibility, or yung brother's keeper, moral code, code, inner person, is good but behavior can be bad. Changes is the only certainty. Work ethics, self-reliance, psychological, converges with philosophical, for example, guilt skills. It believes that therapeutic community is a place where one can change and fall. So, naniniwala sila na isa ang therapeutic community na makakatulong para mabago yung tao na yon. The group can foster change. Individuals must take responsibility. Structures must accommodate this. Act as if go through the motion. There are district categories of activity that help promote the change. First, relational behavior management uh, affect emotional, psychological, cognitive, intellectual, spiritual, psychomotor, vocational, super, uh, survival, and skills. So, ito yung mga categories na promote nila para mabago yung tao. These tools serve more than just the purpose of curbing unproductive behavior. They, all, they are also a means used for enforcing community sanctions on behavior that undermine the safety and integrity of the community, such as violations of the cardinal rules of therapeutic community. No drugs, no violence or threat of violence, no sexual acting out, and no stealing. Everything an officer does is meant to erase straight beha uh, behavior and to lead the offender to be committed to right living. When the office give, uh, give seminars and to, uh, tr uh, tutorials, so, hindi lang yung binabago ka pala. Okay? Nagbibigay din sila ng seminars and tutorials para may matutunan ka rin. 
arranges activities focus on the higher power conduct games, educational trips, oh, so may, para rin para silang estudyante, and other recreational activities. We touch on the therapeutic aspect of intellectual and spiritual dimensions. Aside from the role of a direct supervisor, the VPA may be the invited resource persons, donors, sponsors, facilitators, lecturers, and many more during these seminars. The skills training and livelihood activities fall within the preview of therapeutic community vocational and survival skills. So with medical, dental clinics, and environment conservation activities in this aspect, the VPAs can facilitate job placement and can tap community resource for clients' social and physical needs. Therapeutic community is a tool that the administration uses to prepare the client for reintegration to the community as a reform, rehabilitated, productive, drug-free, and law-abiding citizen. So once na natapos na yung mga kailangan nilang o oh, natapos na niya yung mga dapat niyang gawin o natapos na siyang i-reshape, i-reform, okay, lalabas na, sa, lalabas na siya sa community as a reform, rehabilitated, productive, drug-free, and law-abiding person. So, yan yung ginagawa ng therapeutic community natin. Binabago nila yung mga tao na yon na kailangan talaga ng pagbabago. So, that was the end of my module 10 discussion. So, I hope uh, natulungan ko kayo sa mga dito sa subject na to. Okay? So, thank you and God bless.